Morning, everybody. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start doing like a tip of the day. Why not? Um, this be a little tidbit of, you know, just, just a little tip, something to not necessarily drive on any one point unless you want that, then, you know, put it in the comments. Uh, but we'll, uh, I'll try to do that. Try to try to make this a little little different than what everybody else has of talking thirty minutes on stuff. So anyway, the tip of the day I have is transport plate. It's actually two tips, but since it's a transport plate, we'll roll her into one. One, don't forget it. Two, when you get your transport plate, um. Some guys do this and some guys don't. What I do with my transport plate is when they give me the registration for it, I cut that down as small as I can. The company's name, the company's address, city, state, and zip. And I lay it on the back of the transport plate. Then I take clear tape and I put up like clear packing tape and I put over the back of that and en encase it. And then that way, if I do happen to, for that tip one is don't forget your plate, and tip two is tape your registration to the back of the plate. That way, if you do happen to forget it, you can call the dealer and go, hey, look, I forgot my transport plate. Will you guys mail it to the address on the back of it? And uh, nine times out of ten, the dealer will do that. If you got a buddy you know that's headed to that dealer, have him grab your plate. This would be tip three. Have him grab your plate, and you can run your front plate, if it's Indiana transport plates, on the on the trailer until you and your buddy hook up and you get your plate that way. So there, three tip three tips in one day. Um. So anyway, uh, don't forget your plate. Put the address on the back of it. And if at all, either have them mail it back to your home address, mail it to the address on the back of the plate, or have somebody pick it up for you. Um, the very first thing that I do, I guess this would be tip four. Good Lord. I don't want this to be this long. Anyway. Uh, when I get to the lot, before I grab my paperwork, before I go inside, before I do anything, when I, as soon as I pull on that lot, I get out of the truck, I walk all the way to the back of the unit, I grab my plate, and I come back and I put it in the truck. Then I get my paperwork and I go inside. Get in the habit of doing that. Um, I have many, many, many times forgotten my plate. I've had dealers from a good fair amount of the states across the western part of the country mail my plate back to me because I have forgotten. Uh, so, there it is. Remember to remove the plate. Put the address on the back of the plate. If, if can be, have somebody pick it up. Anyway, y'all be safe.